This continues with not only the work of the photographers, but everything else that it, it represents, because truly it is what is represented uh, in the photography that is going to be so life-changing for people who live in this part of Mississauga as well as elsewhere. There's a real intersection of art and nature, and one of the things that morphology does is it says there's beauty in nature and that we should all appreciate it. I think Jim saw that. The waterfront is a true draw. We have 22 kilometers of beautiful waterfront, 250 acres being redeveloped on the Lakeview site. The Jim Tovey was instrumental um, in, in really rehabilitating the land, bringing it back to nature, bringing it back to a shape where we can you know, create this beautiful new cutting edge community that'll be livable, walkable, and also a place where people will work, have recreation, where it'll be culture, innovation, education. Back in 2017, Jim and I were walking the lakefront in the landfill area. Jim said, oh, I wish more people could witness the morphing of our waterfront. This looks like a sculpture garden. Within the next few minutes, Jim totally envisioned the concept of an evolving photography exhibit to artistically document the repurposing of waterfront from industrial back to natural. I am unbelievably proud of Lee Tovey picking up the ball and running with it at an unbelievable pace and putting so much tireless effort into it. She truly is an amazing champion of morphology. What we want to make sure that we have is a legacy for years and years and years to come. This would be the destination to come to. It's the waterfront for everybody. This project is bringing back that, uh, the habitat productivity of this section of Lake Ontario. This is part of what our conservation authorities have been so brilliant at doing across Ontario. Part of what attracted me to work with Jim and how we became such good friends was his love of bringing the arts and science and nature together and it was always a centre for arts and culture and science and this project embodies that. The look that the photographer's eye brings to it, those particular moments when light and water and lake come together, they're never captured in the usual kinds of situations I work in. Without Jim's vision on the waterfront for the conservation area, it wouldn't be there.